Princess Anne marks very unusual anniversary after shocking event. Anne endured an ordeal on this day in 1974. Princess Anne is much loved by the British public for her no-nonsense, matter-of-fact approach. The princess, the hardest-working member of the royal family, frequently delights onlookers with her witty retorts and down-to-earth remarks. And that stoic trait was never more evident than on 20th of March in 1974. On that day, Anne and then-husband Mark Phillips were returning to Buckingham Palace from a charity event when a member of the public attempted to kidnap the princess. The couple's car was stopped in its tracks as Ian Ball, then 26, stopped his Ford Escort in front of them and pulled out a gun. Anne's personal police officer, James Jim Beaton, exited the car to shield her and to try to disarm the man. However, his firearm jammed and he was shot by Ball, as was Anne's chauffeur. Alex Callender, Brian McConnell, a nearby tabloid journalist, also intervened, and was shot in the chest. Ian Ball then approached Anne's car and told her that he intended to kidnap her and hold her for ransom, which he claimed he intended to give to the National Health Service. He told Anne to get out of the car, to which she replied, not bloody likely. Years after the event, the princess spoke about the incident on BBC TV show Parkinson. You can watch her candid comments here. Anne explained, he opened the door, and we had sort of a discussion, about where or where not we were going to go. He said I had to go with him, can't remember why. I said I didn't think I wanted to go. Jim, who ended up being shot three times, also later spoke about the incident telling the BBC, I thought he was an irate motorist. I got out of the front of the car and he shot at me. I had no time to think on anything really which was just as well because thinking isn't one of my specialities. I got level with the door and Ian Ball was speaking to Princess Anne, all I remember her saying is, why do you want me? Jim praised the princess's extremely good actions, saying that she was cool, calm and collected. When Princess Anne came to visit me in hospital we chatted away for a while, said Jim, who was awarded the George Cross for his bravery. And she said thank you very much. Dot. Oh baby, do you wanna hold me? Come closer, I want you a lady. I know you're gonna never love me. Oh, your touch. It's like in the 80s Bye.